Hey, at 448, as we talk temperatures this morning, in case you're getting ready to head out the door, we're actually running a little bit warmer in central Arizona in comparison to 24 hours ago. And the reason is, is because we've got a few high clouds that have been drifting in. And they're going to be hard to see a little bit here on satellite clouds and radar. But if you look closely, you can kind of see that shadow of those clouds across Levine, Phoenix, Chandler, Mesa here this morning. There are high clouds that are streaming in from the south. And I think as we go through the morning today, we'll continue to see these high clouds streaming in, but they're not going to block out that sun much. So we're still going to feel a nice warm up through the day today, but they're just making for a little bit of a milder start here this morning. So we're down to 53 in Phoenix so far, a little bit milder than at this time yesterday. 41, our temperature in Casa Grande. Meanwhile, we're in the upper 40s at Lake Havasu and mid 40s in Bullhead City. And you'll notice that Flagstaff, at least at this moment, holding on to the 20s. I think you'll dip down into the teens briefly this morning as we approach sunrise. Uh, but again, a little bit milder than where you ended up yesterday. 27, our temperature in Sholo and 23 right now in Window Rock. A Across the valley, no 30s at this point. Can't rule out a few 30s out there, but we likely won't see as many as what we saw yesterday morning. Our temperature right now in Ahwatukee, 45. It's 51 in Tempe, 45 in Peoria, and 51 in Surprise. Meanwhile, checking in at 48 in Scottsdale, 47 in Anthem, and low 40s right now in Gilbert and in Queen Creek, both of you checking in at 43 degrees. So here's how the morning shapes up. Again, I do think we're going to get a little cooler, as we always do, right around sunrise, which is in that 7 o'clock hour at about 7.03 here this morning. And and then we start to warm with temperatures climbing quickly into the mid 50s a.m., mid-60s by 11 o'clock, and then I think we're going to see Phoenix hit, head into the 70s by as early as lunchtime today, so about an hour earlier than when we saw the 70s yesterday, and then highs today up to 80 degrees. So we're talking temperatures that are running 5 to 10 degrees above normal, but 80 in Phoenix, 80 in Mesa, 80 in Levine, we'll make it to 80 in Peoria too. Meanwhile, 75 for a high today in Anthem, 79 in Deer Valley, and up to 79 today in Queen Creek. It's going to be warmer across the state too. That high reaches 55 in Flagstaff have today. 70 for high in Kingman, 60 in Sholo, and we'll make it into the mid to upper 60s today in Payson, Sedona, and Prescott. A gorgeous day really across the state. Just a little bit warm here in the valley. And it looks like we may hold on to those 80s for at least one more day. Two days in the 80s though. That's it. After that, we've got a storm system that's going to drop those temperatures back into the low 70s Thursday before we start to warm things back up Friday and into the weekend. But then we've got another storm that we're watching for this weekend that'll cool us off again and even bring some rain chances. Now you'll notice today that we mainly see those high clouds, but otherwise it's staying dry. Storm system number one comes in Wednesday night rather into Thursday morning. It's going to bring just a chance for a few flurries to northeast Arizona. Not much snow. The rest of the state too is looking dry, but this storm will bring more winds and again is going to cool us off from the 80s today and tomorrow down into the low 70s by Thursday. Then that next storm system comes in this weekend bringing more winds and another drop in temperatures with a chance for rain now too. We'll talk more in detail about that storm here in the next half hour.